Thanks, Alexis. The Rock Church has two exciting events going on this weekend. Joining me this morning is Pastor Ricky Page and Sports Director Marcus Preciado with more on the new East County location and the battle for the troops boxing match, which we'll get to in a moment. But first, good morning to the both of you. Good morning. First of all, let's talk about the new location. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's in El Cajon mm -hmm. and uh, it used to be a, a Michael's and we've come in and renovated. Actually, we're, we're starting the renovation process, but we uh, we just have it or demoed at this point. Obviously, yeah. your biggest location, your ma your main campus is, sure. is in Point Loma. You also have another one right uh, up in uh, the San Marcos? Is yes, it, yes, right? yes. Yep, no, so sure. why the expansion? I mean, is, is, I know the one at Liberty Station is just huge is when it comes to people. Yeah, you know, it's it's difficult with a, a church our size to, to really send people into their neighborhoods to invite their friends and their neighbors to church when they're driving 30 or 40 mile or minutes to, to get to the campus. And yeah. so this is a way that we can just really uh, empower the people that attend the Rock, our, our Rock Church family, to make a, a difference in their community. So we move into the community and they can go right in. You know, I, I, I know traffic has been an issue at, at times in Point Lumbo. What do you tell the folks in El Cajon now that, that you're moving in? Well, the traffic in El Cajon is going to be no problem. And in fact, the facility that we're we're uh, renovating has a huge parking lot and right. the whole area is pretty vacant on Sundays. So they're excited about the traffic. Uh, so the traffic isn't really the yeah. big focus though. The, the main sure. focus is Absolutely. getting into their neighborhood. Absolutely, area. and I would think it's gonna uh, take some of the traffic away from the other location anyway, Absolutely. because you'll have sure. the, those yeah. folks out there. What? Yeah. Uh, let's talk about a sporting event too, because yeah. it's happening on the same day, but it's a yeah. separate event. What's going on? Well, we're having Battle for the Troops. It starts at 11 o'clock right there at the Rock Church, and it's a great way to uh, you know, do an innovative event to bring people in the church, also to uh, help out in a, in a practical way, and all the proceeds go to the to wounded warriors, wounded veterans here in San Diego. It's going to be uh, about 15 amateur events right there smack in the middle wow. of the sanctuary. <laughs> you know, we'll have a two-time heavyweight champ of the world, Chris Bird, joining us as well. And it's going to be a great family event in the back. As you know, there'll be skating demos, karate demos, MMA demos, um, and eating demos, which I'll be doing the eating yeah, demos. Oh, yeah, so, I bet. You know. Okay, the, uh, the Rock Church is always on the cutting edge. You're holding it, somewhat of a violent sport in the middle of a sanctuary. Talk about that a little bit. Yeah, well, you know, it, it is a sport. We oversee the sports, and, and it's a great opportunity to take what people are doing, yeah. what they're into, and showing them, hey, you know what? This, it, it's not about being religious. You know, it's about knowing that God loves you, that Jesus loves you. Whether you're getting punched in the face or not, Jesus still loves you. And it's an amateur event, and so we're excited about it. And being it. healthy and taking care of your body is part of the whole, the whole uh, thing, absolutely, right? Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, talk about the matches, because I know there's some women's matches in this thing as well, right? Yeah, there's some women's matches. There's, there's, there's youth matches. There's uh, Olympic-level matches as well. So we've got something for everybody. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a great time. Okay, what are the times for this event? And, at, and this is the Point Loma location. Correct. It starts at 11 o'clock. Mm -hmm. uh, doors open. There'll be family things going on in, in, in the back of it, music, food prizes, giveaways, and then the fights start around 1 o'clock. And how much to get in? It's $25 to get in, uh -huh. unless you go early on their website, uh, sdrock.com, and then you can get them, I believe, for $15 And this earlier. is all for Wounded Warriors? All for Wounded Warriors, correct. That's awesome. All right, let's get back to the groundbreaking. What time does that take place? And that's also on Saturday, right? It's also on Saturday, and, and we won't punch you in the face, and it's <laughs> a free event, so, you know, there's an option. Uh, but what happens on Saturday is that at 4.30, we're going to have a, the inside the building, which mm -hmm. is just an empty warehouse at this point. Uh, we're gonna have a lot of stuff for kids, a kids zone, and uh, skate demos and that kind of stuff. Food trucks, all the best food trucks in San Diego are gonna be out. Uh, Green Co, which is a, a toasted cheese sandwich food truck, if you can mm -hmm. believe it. Uh, they're <laughs> gonna be there. And then uh, around 5:30, we're gonna begin a program with some worship. Pastor Miles is gonna share, share some vision, and we're, we'll hang out to about 7:30. And you will be the new pastor at this church? Or yes, sir. Okay. Well, what is your background? Where did you come from? At the other church, I guess? Or yeah, been so I've been at the Rock for seven years now, uh -huh. roughly seven years, a little under, uh -huh. as a pastor in different uh, slots and locations. On, uh, uh, and this is just the, my new assignment. Yeah. So the, the great thing about it is uh, this will be a satellite campus, so the, the messages will be piped in live from Point Loma, okay. but I'll be the on-site campus pastor uh, for, for those <laughs> folks. So you'll be coming. still getting a message from Miles McPherson as well, too, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, talk about when it's going to open. I know you're groundbreaking this Saturday. When, you, when are you hoping to get things rolling? So our, our best guess is uh, late summer, early fall, and we're really uh, shooting for, for early fall. So I, that's that's when we'll have the doors open. Okay, so two events. You can make them both, I guess. Yeah. You could go yes, from Point Loma absolutely. out to Elko home for the second. The military, by the way, uh, $10 a ticket for military for that day. I okay. just want to express that as All well. Right. Gentlemen, thank you very much for being awesome. on with Thanks we for having me. Certainly. Thanks. Still to come on Good Morning San Diego, over 22 million people in the United States are living with.